everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome to my channel, to my returning viewers, my subscribers. Thank you so much. You mean the world to me. I could not keep up and do my channel without you. So thank you, thank you, thank you. If you are new to my channel, I hope you click that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos. And I, oh, I just appreciate your help, your comments, your support. It just means the world to me. So anyway, today we have got my second Wannable box. It's actually my first Wannable edit box. The first one was a clearance edition, so this one is regular full-priced items. I'm excited to get into it. You can go online to peek, but I figured at this point you can't do it until actually, I think after you receive it from UPS or whatever drops it off. So at that point I just thought, I might as well be surprised like the rest of you. So anyway, it does come in, uh, of course, this little Wannable box. And what I learned from the first time is that in case you do forget what to do next, it's got everything that you need to know uh, printed right here on the box, on the side of the boxes here. But anyway, um, it, there is a $20 styling fee. If you, $20 styling fee. If you use my link below, and I'm really sad about this, but um, anyway, if you use my link or anybody's link, you give them, so if you use my link, I get a $25 credit towards my next fix, my next box but it doesn't look like the people that use the link in anything and I just I just think that's so unfair I mean every other box if you use somebody else's link they get something you get something and I would rather I not get anything but someone using my link get the credit so I just think that's unfair and I really think they want to should really look at that um, whether they just waive the styling fee for somebody's uh, first box or don't give me the credit or give you a choice I would much rather give this to someone else to have them try it but but anyway that said you get seven items in the box if you keep five or more you get a 25 percent discount um, the styling fee the twenty dollars is applied to anything that you purchase you can go online they have a stream that you can go on and click on different things whether you decline it or say you like or request or something like that so they do look at that to uh, kind of help style your box for you and of course the questionnaire to put in different information about your size um, you know your height your weight things like that what you like what you don't like um, anyway where I got the clearance edit first and this was of course being styled at the same time it would have made sense to me since they were sending that out first that they probably would have waited until they got to see what I kept and what worked and what didn't work before they styled this one, but they were kind of like styled at the same time. So to me, if it was my company and I knew I sent one out, I would have waited to get the results back to see what I styled, but who knows what's in there could could be perfect for me. So anyway, I'm excited to get into that and um, I'll show you that in a second, but you know, I haven't had this in so long. And I've got my little Halloween glass here. And this one is by Lolita. So this has got little witches off to the side all the way around it and I got a Cosmo I haven't had one of these in years and um, when I was at the Target the other night getting the stuff on my rotisserie chicken and my apple salad I got some cranberry juice because I knew I had citron vodka down there somewhere so I had that in the lime juice added some cranberry juice cocktail and I've got myself a Cosmo ah so good but anyway getting back into the Wannable Mix. So one thing that I liked, and uh, well, it's not that I liked, but I just think it's a really cute idea, is I do put a sticker on it, which I'm going to knock my glass over so I don't want to get any closer, but it does say, it says, styled for Nancy. So I just think that is really, really a nice touch. And so anyway, this is my burrito. It's nice and square, but I can see some camo. I see maybe a gray maybe like a headed mauve, maybe a plaid, maybe black, and deep purple. So anyway, this looks exciting. I am dying to get into this and check it out, so I will be right back with the try-on.
that was so much fun. I needed to wet my whistle, so I had to go and fill up my glass with another Cosmo. So anyway, thank you again for joining me. And this is the part that I really need your help because I can talk myself into buying everything or thinking I look terrible in everything and send everything back. So your comments really, really help me. So anyway, um, you do get a prepaid mail to send anything back that you don't want. It does come with this uh, prepaid label from the USPS, but they also send you one from the UPS that you can just put on top of this. And I do prefer to use UPS because I have a pickup just about every day at work. And as soon as they scan it, you just you can kind of track it from there instead of just putting it in like the blue post office box and driving away. But anyway, I think I got some fantastic items in this box. I think my stylist, Sophia, did an incredible job. So I am very pleased. Um, I'll just show you her note real fast. You can always freed it, freeze it to read what she says and how you put things together. And then there's a picture of Sophia. And then I also, because I did this from, um, signed up after watching Kristen from Kristen Moments of Sanctuary, her, her video in her last Wannable. Um, and she had just got some denim that I loved and there was a pair of joggers that she got and I loved, loved those and some slacks. So all those items that I requested from Kristen's video, yeah, they didn't have it, but that's okay. I did get some uh, awesome things and I hope Kristen gets to use that uh, styling fee. I just think it's a bummer that the, the person that uses the link doesn't get anything because if anyone uses my link, I would like to say, oh, if you use my link, um, you get this. And it's like, it's like, it's all for yeah so i i think wannable needs to fix that I, I just don't think that's right but moving on shall we so this first item and i should have read her note because um the way i styled it i did not like it and i had this all set in my mind to return it so this is the uh, solid long sleeve pocket henley it's in uh, heather charcoal size small it's from west key and it's 52 dollars. so it's like this you know the donald stanley henley with the buttons here you got this pocket it is soft I, I will give you that it's soft it's very long it's a tunic length so it really would be better for leggings um over the the way i had it styled was like oh that was so wrong that was just not right it was not a fair representation of it you could see the uh the ribbon tie through this you could see the back pockets through us and i was thinking this is so thin it's not worth the money but i will try it with the uh the leggings that she sent and with some other leggings that I have to see if it gives me a different point of view and which is that's part of the beauty too of getting these things to try on at home is that you can try things from your closet if something doesn't work um, with how you tried it you can try it again so oh so next I want to go in sequence here see these earrings and these are so so pretty so let's see if these focus but they're the gold tone, but this silver in here, there's some clear beading and different shades of gray and gold. And it's just so, so pretty. So I am definitely thinking of keeping these and they send it to you in this cute little pouch. So that is so adorable. And those are for $42 and I am thinking about keeping those. Next is these leggings and I'm a little on the fence about the leggings. Um, these are the Signature Ponte Leggings in Superior Check, Extra Small by Lice. I'm going to call it Lice or Lease because otherwise if I call it Lice, that just sounds disgusting uh, for $88. And $88, I think, for leggings is a price that you would see normally with, with Stitch Fix and some of the other ones. So I think the pricing is fair. It's like this um, herringbone check and it does have some rust going through it, some rust striping going through it. And I like the way I styled it with, um, cause if I was going to wear this to work, I would probably want to dress it up instead of the Henley, I think would give a casual look, but if I were going to wear leggings to work, I prefer to dress them up. So I did like it with uh, the way I styled it with the booties and the blazer. Um, I'm just not sure if maybe I should go up to a small because Dunkin' Donuts is killing me with their large coffee iced coffees but i did recently switch to medium so that might help so anyway i'm leaning towards keeping those just not sure if i should size up or not these the camel joggers and these are ones that i picked 
so I've got no one to blame but myself. These are from Cut From The Cloth, which is usually a, it's a great quality. It's a great brand. I have no trouble with Cut From The Cloth denim. These are called the Tyler Camo Joggers and Olive Extra Small. They're $89, which I think is a standard price for Cut From The Cloth. It is a true jogger, so you got this um, banding right here, which is really nice and comfortable. It's not tight at all. Got a nice waistband that's not tight at all. You got this here, but it, I don't think it's really going to tighten anything. It's just the way it is. Um, I just could not wait to get these off. I just felt like a slob. Um, yeah, and, and I mean, I've got some other joggers recently, and I feel comfortable in them. And um, I would feel comfortable wearing some of the joggers that I've got to work. Um, I would not want to wear these out of the house. I wouldn't even want to wear them in the house. I, I just felt like a slob in them. I just, I just think the fit on me just was not right, but but they are nice for the right person uh next this top oh my gosh this is so thick it's so soft um if you get this you are going to love it so this is called the Hasi front pocket hoodie in macchiato which reminds me of macchiato coffee uh size small it's vintage havana and it's 58 dollars and this is oh it is just so nice the quality here is perfect it's heavy it's soft it's just cozy comfort I got this the detail right here with these metal things like you have on the end of sneakers. Just gives a just gives it a nice little look. It's nice quality. Got a nice kangaroo pocket. It is a high low, and then you got that little locking slit. So this I love. This is oh my gosh! If you get this, you are not going to want to take it off. It is that comfortable. Oh, next is this cardigan, and I wish I had better camera because right here this is it's just looking like a you know, regular shade of blue, but this is a deep, deep purple. It is so, so pretty. Uh, so this is called the Dressy Cardi with stud sleeve detail. They're calling it Deep Amethyst, size small for $79. It's by W, a uh, Wannable brand. And again, the attention to detail on this. It's got this like ribbon banding with these studs right here uh, along the waistband. It's got this kind of different texture that goes all the way around the front and back. It's a nice duster length, so down to the knee, and then it does have this little walking slit right here. So, oh, if you could see this in person, you would fall in love with it. This is the most beautiful shade of purple I have ever seen. Love it. Last, we have this dress. This was also on my wish list, and when I got it out, when I opened it up out of the uh, burrito thing, I was like, why would I pick that? I mean, it's different kind of like a texture material. It's a cotton blend. And it's got the short sleeves and it's like why would you want to put long short sleeves like this going into winter but then i put it on and i love it so anyway this is called the split cowl button dress in black size small it's by nisha and it's 68 dollars just have these buttons here that are working so that you can put it up a little bit higher or a little bit lower if that's the look that you're going for or wherever you're comfortable around your neckline or maybe if you have a different necklace right here you might want that cowl neck opened a little bit more but anyway, the sleeves were a funny length, but you can push them up to go right over your elbow. And I think I can live with that. Some people would probably say, Nancy, you're too old and it's too short on you. But, you know, I'm comfortable with this length for now. Um, and I think, you know, I'm not comfortable wearing shorts that some people are. So if, I don't know, if some people can can say you can be in your mid to late 60s and still wear shorts, why can't you wear a dress that's over your knee? As long as you're comfortable in it, right? So anyway, um, it's a cotton blend. Um, I think it was a, a little bit see-through. So I don't know. Do they still make slips? Or maybe a nice heavy pair of tights under it? I don't know. But um, anyway, um, it just feels really comfortable on. It's a breathable material. Um, and I think this is easy enough to dress up. I mean, I had fun dressing it up with um, the animal print, the little blazer with the matching booties. But I think a nice... Um, blazer would dress this up for work or a nice cardigan so anyway i am thinking about keeping this so i would love to hear your thoughts on that and that is everything in my first wannable edit and i am very happy i think sophia did an incredible job for me and um i would definitely try this again i think i'm signed up for every month but i'll have to check to be sure but um i want to thank everyone for joining me i hope you give this video a thumbs up i look forward to your comments because they do help me immensely and sometimes just playing it back it's like you might look at something um 
you know, and first in the monitor, and you think, oh, wow, I love this. This is so cool. And then you play it back, and you're like, what the heck was I thinking? Or you try something on, and it's like, oh, I don't like it. But then you see the playback, and, and it's something that you do like. And just getting another perspective from honest opinions from you, just it's just refreshing, and I really enjoy it reading your comments. So I want to thank everyone for joining me. I had a fun time with you tonight. I hope uh, everyone gives this video a thumbs up and we will chat again soon. Bye-bye.